now we are doing exercise 1.3 question number six question number six we have let me write down the question question says so here is a question locate on the number line the point representing the following number and the question question number six roman number one it is two root three we have to represent two root three on a number line so how to do it's simple first let us start by representing first you draw a line a very straight line and let us give make it straight a little bit a bit longer okay now let me give a marking of the points here so this point let's say zero one here two here three here four here five here six here and minus one like this you just represent i hope you know how to represent all these things now we need to represent two root three i hope you know how to represent root three how to do that let us first represent root three so let me write down solution i can write down three is two plus one right i can write down three is two plus one but two is not a square number so i have to write down three is one plus one plus one i can write down like this now why i can write down one is one square plus one square plus one square i have to write down three in terms of square of a number i can write down two plus one also three is equal to two plus one but two is not a square of any number it is a prime number it is not a square of any number so i have to write down in terms of square of a number so i wrote down one square plus one square plus one square now let us start let us start this one we have done previously even so first let me represent one so from here zero you take one straight line one here this one you are supposed to take from here a straight line one this one now after that after that after this one this one is done now take another one and draw vertically take your protector and make it 90 degree here draw a line this must be one in length okay with one in length the length from zero to one this length and this from one above this one must be same okay i hope it is same even though i'm not using my scale so after i join this line now what does it happen here one is this one this is also one let me write down a b c okay so what i can do is we know so here we can write down we can write after that in triangle a b c in triangle a b c in triangle a b c i can write on a b square is equal to a c square plus b c square we can write down this is pythagoras theorem if you don't know what is this this is pythagoras theorem so i can write down all these things as so using pythagoras theorem theorem in triangle a b c so we are using pythagoras theorem in triangle a b c so what can we write a b square is equal to b c square plus a c square which will be equal to a b square is equal to b c square it is one square plus a c square a c square is one square so one plus one it is two so a b square is equal to two so a b will be equal to root two so i got a b to be root two but i want to represent three root three right root three is my question first let us target only this root three so i want to represent root three so what shall i do what shall i do so let me take this one and keep it somewhere else let me take this and what shall i keep mm.
let me make it small and keep in the corner here okay so that i may have space here if you need you can just you can just take the screenshot now and just copy okay now let me just write here let me come back here okay now what shall i do is i need a root tree question is asking me to find out two root tree so let me make it a root tree here how to do that from this line from this line make again another 90 degree make 90 degree from here okay it must be 90 degree as well as the length must be one so this is one again here and this is 90 degree again make sure you use protector and draw properly after that let me draw in these two lines and now name it a b c let's say this is d now what does db become so let me write down again using pythagoras theorem i can write down the next line using pythagoras theorem theorem in triangle a d c or d a c d a c pythagoras theorem in d a triangle d a c triangle d a no d a b this triangle so it will be d a d b square is equal to d a square plus a b square d a is one square a b is a b is how much root two whole square so one square is one root two square square and root cancel two b d square so b d will be equal to two plus one three square will go that side it will become root so i got the db to be root three okay after this after this what are you supposed to do is after doing this much take bd take your compass and the pin side of the compass the pointing side of the compass place it here pencil side you keep it here in d and after that you draw a curve okay you draw a curve like this so what you're going to do is take pin side of the compass here at b pencil side at d and draw a curve like this and the point that you meet the curve the curve this point you name it e let's okay now what does b e means so b e is equal to b e is equal to b is equal to b d right b d and b e are equal which is equal to how much root 3 but the question is asking you to find out 2 root 3 so what you will do is take b e take your compass pin side this side take same thing that you have taken just now taking pin side compass and pencil side don't change the compass size okay don't change the radius of the compass that we call as radius don't change it you just keep the compass pin here and draw another arc draw another the pencil the pin side you keep it at e and draw another arc like this here and name it f okay so therefore bf what is bf bf is double of be first you have drawn the compass using the compass you have drawn be first after that same size you have drawn ef again so it will be double of two of be or i can write down i can write down what is bf bf is be plus ef and be and ef are equal right be plus ef also is equal to be which will be equal to be and db are equal so be be it will be two b and be be and bd are equal so two bd and bd is equal to how much root three given here bd is equal to two root three and d bf is your required line so bf or f is the required point so they are asking you to rocket number line so f represent represent two root three okay if you write this much done your answer is correct i hope you understood this much a little bit messy because my page is not that big enough but still then i'm i was i hope i'm able to make you understand if you didn't understand please do write in the comment below i'll be happy to help you again that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video